Billy the Kid was sentenced to uh, death by a jury and judge after he shot the sheriff of the county, Lincoln County, uh, during the, uh, the uh, Lincoln County War. And um, it was William Brady was the name of the sheriff. Uh, he was held at the Lincoln County Courthouse in New Mexico, and it was uh, there that he uh, uh, was given a gun. Somehow he got a gun given to him, and he was able to escape. Uh, he shot one sheriff, killed him on the way out, and then his nemesis, uh, the guard known as Bob Ollinger, uh, he shot uh, down in cold blood. And uh, before he did so, he, he made note of the fact that he made uh, Bob look at him or recognize him before he shot him dead. Uh, Bob Ollinger, as far as we know, was the last man killed by Billy the Kid before he escaped and ultimately was captured and, uh, and killed by uh, Sheriff Pat Garrett at Fort Sumner uh, some weeks later. Uh, this little note I hold in my hand used to be at the Gilcrease Museum in, um, uh, in Tombstone, Arizona. And it was a note that was found in the pocket of Bob Ollinger after he was killed by the kid. And it's uh, in Bob's handwriting, evidently. It says, Billy Kidd found guilty of murder in the first degree, um, April the 9th, 1881, for the murder of William Brady, Sheriff, Lincoln County, New Mexico. Um, at any rate, it's, uh, it's from Masilla, New Mexico, where the uh, court was held uh, April 10th, 1881. And this note was found in, like I say, Bob Ollinger when he was murdered by Billy the Kid.